Allostatic load is the wear and tear on your body that accumulates when you've been under chronic or traumatic stress. Although stress is designed to protect you and keep you safe in the short term, prolonged periods of fight, flight and freeze can be the beginning of dysfunction. They can have negative effects on both your brain and your body that can lead to chronic symptoms that then go on to become chronic illnesses. If your mind-body system doesn't get to return to its equilibrium or baseline after a stressful period, it can have an effect on the immune system, the hormonal system, as well as your nervous system. When allostatic load first begins to accumulate, you might experience symptoms. So these can be things like anxiety, insomnia, fatigue, restlessness, gut issues, or pain. These symptoms can be thought of as yellow flags, and they might be trying to get your attention to say, hey, we need support and we need to recover properly. As time goes on, and if dysregulation continues, these symptoms can then turn into chronic health issues. So things like what started out to be a gut problem can turn into something like IBS or SIBO. So if we intervene early enough with practices, we can actually reverse the effect of or reverse the allostatic load. And one of the best ways that we do this is through bottom up and top down regulation practices. Bottom up regulation involves recalibrating your nervous system. We create an effect in the body, which has a positive flow onto the emotional brain, which in then has a positive cascading effect up to the thinking brain. Top down regulation involves bringing sensations in the body into awareness and this is something that may have been affected by trauma. We know that thoughts, stories and narratives have a flow and effect to the emotional part of the brain which also has an effect on the body. Integrating these bottom-up and top-down exercises improves regulation. It also helps to foster resilience and it can reverse the effects of allostatic load. This is a way that we can get to the core of treating many chronic health issues rather than just trying to address the symptoms. We know that just focusing on the symptoms doesn't actually get to the heart of the problem, which is dysregulation of the nervous system. When the nervous system becomes dysregulated, so too does the immune system. This can cause things like allergies, asthma, rashes, inflammation, and even eventuate to rheumatoid arthritis. We know that the hormonal system is also dysregulated when the nervous system is. Allostatic load is easily demonstrated in the heart. So under chronic stress, when the heart is having to beat faster and work harder, it can eventually lead to things like hypertension and make us at risk for things like heart disease. So many of these illnesses can be thought of stress-related issues. And if we can get better at regulating the nervous system, by using the right tools and techniques, we can reverse allostatic load and have a positive effect on both the brain and the body. I'll be holding a masterclass shortly that's specific for reducing the effects of allostatic load. If you'd like to learn the interventions that can help and that will hence have a nice flow and effect to improving chronic health issues, then I'd love to have you join me. I'll pop the details below.